Hello, and welcome to Larissa's Kitchen. cool as of late so today we're putting together a tuna noodle casserole which is a classic comfort meal it goes together very quickly so let's see what we're gonna need this is a casserole so there's really not too much prep work to do although we do need to cook our 12 ounces of medium egg noodles and drain the tuna and the diced pimentos you don't have to but I think it helps to thaw the frozen peas before you add them in now we'll be mixing all of this together minus the breadcrumbs, which we'll be putting on for the last five minutes of this bake. So let's get started. I forgot to mention this while I was listing the ingredients, which are of course always next to me, as well as the full recipe and instructions in the description box below. We will be using four teaspoons of this. And you can use any tuna that you like for this. It does not have to be chunk white or chunk light. Just make sure that it is in water and not oil. And I like to use half cream and half buttermilk for this. The buttermilk gives it a nice tang. Okay, I'm gonna mix this together first before I add in the noodles. And my oven is preheated to 400 degrees. I've switched over to a much larger spatula. That other one works so much better for getting things out of cans. Then this is going in a sprayed nine by 13 inch casserole dish, although mine is oval. If I hadn't baked this with the bread on top, this probably would have browned up just a little bit more. I'm serving this with our sourdough pizza shaped into a baguette. Now I've never made these before on this show, but you just make the sourdough pizza dough, cut it in half, and form it into the baguettes. Like all casseroles, I think this works best if you let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes before serving. It's time to give this casserole a taste, and I know it tastes great because I made it several times. So, it is hot. I will probably burn myself. Let's 
get some here. A stray noodle. Mm-hmm. Very comforting. Thank you for visiting Larissa's Kitchen. If you enjoyed this video, give the like button a click and don't forget to leave a comment. We're always happy to hear from you. If you haven't already, subscribe to our channel and don't keep us a secret. Share our videos with your friends and family. You can follow us on Facebook for behind the scenes pics and videos and on Twitter for upcoming videos and the random cat picture.